let us now talk about icon fonts. What are they? How are they useful? And how do we make use of them in designing our website? Icon fonts provide a very flexible way of including tiny images into our web pages that can be styled just like text. So that is the reason icon fonts um, prove very, very useful in designing websites. Using icon fonts, you can take a web page like this and quickly turn it into a web page like this. Note the use of icons together with the text in the nav bar. And then when you scroll down to the footer, you can see more icons being used in the footer and also your social media links are now replaced by social media buttons here. So these are the changes that icon fonts will enable you to do to your website. So as I briefly mentioned earlier, icon fonts are a set of symbols or glyphs that can be used in your website design. These can be used just like regular fonts, just like regular text fonts that you use in your web uh, website. The advantage is that you can style them and then expand and contract them and, uh, and uh, use all typical stylings that you use on your text uh, for your um, icons also. Uh, they are seen as a popular lightweight replacement for simple graphics that you can use uh, in your web pages, simply graphics or images that you can use in your web pages. And they are very, very useful in designing uh, your web pages. There are many uh, icon font packs that are available in the uh, market. One of the most popular ones is Font Awesome, which I'm going to talk about next. Font Awesome, as I said, is a very popular icon font. It is available free for use in designing your web pages, and it has been extensively used by many different websites. We'll learn how to download Font Awesome and then use it in our web page in the exercise that follows this lecture. Using Font Awesome in your uh, web page is as simple as using some classes that are applied to an I or a span tag in your web page uh, HTML code. So uh, once you include the CSS and the fo font files that are available through Font Awesome, then it is very straightforward to make use of Font Awesome in your web pages. Another common feature that you would see on web pages is the use of uh, social uh, site buttons there, like uh, Facebook, Twitter, uh, Google+, and uh, YouTube, and many others. Now, fortunately for us, there is this other um, CSS file called as Bootstrap Social um, that you can download and make use of in including various um, social media site buttons into your web page. Uh, we will see the use of Bootstrap Social in the exercise that follows. Uh, once you download the Bootstrap Social CSS file, you include that in your uh, web page. And then together with the Font Awesome icons, you can combine that with Bootstrap Social's classes to include various um, social media buttons on your web pages. So without further ado, let's move to the next exercise where we're going to use both Font Awesome and Bootstrap Social, uh, a modified version of Bootstrap Social.css file that I provide on the uh, exercise uh, instructions that you should download and include in your um, Confusion project and make use of it in the exercise. Mm -hmm.